have to redo this part mainly because that was in Cantonese and a lot of people don't understand Cantonese apparently. So I'm going to be doing this video in English. This is going to be my first English debut video. I don't think I'm good at English. I'm pretty bad at it. And if there's anything grammatically wrong, forgive me for that. Anyways, hi guys, my name is Ruth and I'm from Hong Kong, currently 18 years old. And I'm studying in University of British Columbia. First year engineering. I only came here like two months ago and I don't know much about Vancouver or Canada. But right now, I'm gonna film this video about the dorm that I'm staying in. So for the past two and a half months, since I last uploaded, I haven't done much. I have like my orientation cam, which is really fun. I met a lot of people. It's like a really good experience. And then I, my school starts and I started to adjust my timetable and like um, going to classes and lectures. Apparently I was too lazy to film my daily life. I am currently in a reading break and I could finally have time to edit my videos. So yeah. I'm currently staying in Place Fanny residence. For every first year, we only have three different choices. One is Totem Park, a second is Place Fanny, a third is Orchard Commons. And let me tell you, Orchard Commons, they mainly sell their few and private suites. Place Fanny, we sell community, community because our stuff are pretty old. And if you're staying here, I pay like 1,000 Canadian dollars per month for this single room and you can also change it to like a share room. So two people sharing one bedroom. Fun fact, I came here and I thought everywhere, like everywhere else, we have air conditioner in Hong Kong because the average temperature is around 32, 33. But here, it's like there's no air conditioner. It's heater because the average temperature is it gets really really cold now it's november it's freezing cold six degrees these two months i train up to be like cold resistance <laughs> so no further ado let's, let's get, 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 get the video. video so for this part of the video i'm just gonna do a voiceover because i'm too lazy to re-record everything so here we go this is my bedroom it's a single person room it comes with a twin xl bed and it comes with a mattress it has like a table on the side a wardrobe um, beside the bed and that's it so i did some testing on the bed i jump up and down but the results are please don't jump on your bed because it makes a lot of sound you want to get on the bed <laughs> The bed is adjustable, so usually people just raise their bed and fit a mini fridge underneath it. So here I am next to my snack bar, and I'm just complaining about how my common washroom is so inconvenient, I have to rush out to brush my teeth, and I can't survive without ramen, so I have a lot. And also, I have 8 a.m. class every day, so I need nutrition. This is my breakfast bar, I survive with this. I just love complaining about my classes carpet cleaner i'm just slightly slightly germaphobic so that's why i have to clean my floor as i was recording the video i have two pictures hung on the wall they're both drawn by my father one is my corgi and the other is the view outside my home there are three drawers next to the table but they are all empty because i don't have that much clothes i have a computer a speaker a mouse a led lamp which is also has wireless charging and also, there are more drawers on the side, more space to store stuff. This is my LED kettle, I love it. It changes color with temperature. And paired with my LED speaker, um, I can literally start a party. Most of my decorations are on the shelf. This is my BTS calendar because I am an army and I love them. And I have a lot of notes, which they're from DSE, and I hate DSE. Lots of sockets in my room, there, there, and also there. I don't have a lot of clothes, so my drawers are pretty empty, but it fits most of my clothes. This is my laundry bag. There is a full-size mirror beside it, and I'm obsessed with it. Opening this door, we have access to my wardrobe. There is a shoe rack underneath it. 
It can store about four pairs of shoes, and I have a plain collection of clothes. It's not colorful, except this one, which I really like. It's a dress.、Um, I designed this dress,、um, the patterns and stuff, and I get my friends to sign on it. So it's pretty cool, and I love them. This is my vacuum cleaner. It's a lifesaver. The view outside my room is very creepy. Literally, people could just see me, like, cause I'm on the first floor, and people on the sidewalk could just see me. So I have to put my blinds on all the time. We do have a common area slash common kitchen, and we do share a common fridge. People can just share their food there or store their food there. But if you don't want anyone to steal your food, people usually put on a sticky note. We have a microwave, a sink to watch to wash things, and people would share food if they have too much, and then put it on the counter just like this. Oh my god, the washroom is the worst part. I only love it because I could go in there and take selfies, which are which is like my favorite part. Otherwise, it's not. Cause you know, like the door, they sound so creepy, and you can literally see the other person next to you. Cause the stools are too tall. But the shower, I guess, is like a regular one. You know, like there's always some disgusting stuff in it. But I guess it just works, and it it's just fine. Finally, life update. I got my ears pierced. I got like a helix here. Helix, and then one new ear ear loop piercing here. Um, this was old. I got this like two years ago. And then on the left side, um, I got a tattoo. It's temporary. It's from Inbox. Also, if Inbox you're watching this, please sponsor me because I don't have any sponsors. But I really like your temporary tattoo, and I would highly recommend people to get that because they're just so good. Um, I got this as like the BTS fake love series. It's been on my neck for like more than one and a half weeks, so it's starting to fade out the colors. But it's temporary, right? And it stays there for two weeks. I got like another one on the left side. It was there, but I thought it was the hole was closed. And then the piercer told me that it wasn't, so he got another jewelry and just stuck it back in. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do enjoy this video, make sure you guys to subscribe and like this video. Cause that, Cause gives, that me gives me motivation, motivation to, do to do more videos, more videos and, make and make more awesome, awesome videos. videos. Even though I don't think I upload regularly, I can't regularly upload things because let's just say I'm just lazy. Please forgive me for that. Um, so I hopefully I would upload more regularly from now on. Not a promise, but a target. And also, make sure to turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss out when I post new videos. I will see you in the next video. Bye. Showed you what heaven could taste like, put it on my tab. Gave you my money and my time.